Easter isn't all about sweets. People love a big holiday meal, and most of those Easter dinners feature one thing, and that would be ham. And while we're celebrating spring, the secret to a great ham comes down to all four seasons, winter, spring, summer, and fall. Behold, the centerpiece of Easter brunches everywhere, the mighty ham. I think it's traditional. I think people would like to eat foods that uh, remind themselves of when they were a kid. S. Wallace Edwards and Sons has been hamming it up for more than 80 years. In 1926, my grandfather started the business. He grew up on a farm curing Virginia hams that he learned how to do from his grandfather because they didn't have refrigeration. They needed to dry cure the meats, so they became shelf stable. Today, the company receives fresh country hams from farms all around their Surrey, Virginia shop and factory. We cure about 50,000 pieces of country hams a year. The secret to their flavorful country ham goes back to Grandpa Edward's special process. We duplicate those seasons, winter, spring, summer, and fall, through temperature-controlled rooms. Each season has an impact on the aging and curing process. This is where the process starts, the winter room, where we show each ham a little bit of love by hand massaging the dry salt cure. They cover the hams in a salt coat, then they chill out in a 40-degree winter room for a couple of weeks. Next, they hang around the 50-degree spring room for another two or three weeks to cure. Then, they're off to the smokehouse. All right, so let's go have a smoke. This is the smokehouse where we leave them on hard hickory wood smoke for five to seven days until we reach that gorgeous mahogany color that we're looking for. Inside, it's a summery smoking hot 85 degrees. Whew, that's a lot of smoke. Next, the hams age for four to 14 months to develop flavor. The longer they age, the stronger the flavor. Hams that age longer than 12 months will sit here for several more weeks in fall-like temperatures around 65 degrees. We check each and every ham with the stick and sniff process to make sure that we have the right amount of cure, the right amount of age. It smells good. Hams with a full aroma of flavor move on to the cooker. We're going to take the basket, we're going to drop it into our cook pot. We'll go ahead and cook them in water for about 14 hours, bring it up to an internal temperature of about 152 degrees. Next, it takes a fiery blaze to glaze them. Brown sugar. Mm. Then they're vacuum sealed and shipped across the country, making ham the highlight of Easter tables everywhere. <laughs>